You have collaborated with your dad on many books. Tell us what it is like to work with your dad. Um, working with my dad is fun. I like him. He's, he's okay. <laughs> um, we, we spend a lot of time talking about things in the first place, and then we go our separate ways to do the work. So it's nice that he trusts me to, to, not, to not mess it up too bad. Yeah. But it's also the sort of thing where I, I, I have a tendency to, I want to live up to his words. Like this book, the words are really big. They're all like, you know, born in the 1940s and blah, blah, blah. blah. You know, they're like, they're sort of stately. Blah, blah, blah. They're not like blah, but you know what I'm saying. <laughs> and so I, I kind of wanted to do paintings that, that lived up to his words. And that was exciting as a challenge. So. Um. What's the best memory of your dad from your childhood? The best memory of dad from my childhood? I have a lot, and I guess that, that's a good question. Um, I'll tell you one of the ones that's two, I'll tell you two that stick out for me in relationship to both this book and also to just having a, my dad used to write on the porch of their house. So he would go out in the morning and uh, so when we lived in Queens, he used to write on the balcony with his typewriter. Um, and, just, and, and, and that's just such a good thing to watch growing up. The other thing is we traveled a lot when I was a kid. And so we went to places like Egypt and Thailand and Mexico. And we'd go around and, and I'd learn both about the history of those places, but also about the history of the United States through that sort of thing. And that was really good.